to my channel and today is going to be all about my July favorites. These are just a collection of items that I've really loved for the last month. I've got a mix, a little bit of makeup, a little bit of hair and skin stuff, and a little bit of a bonus. So if you guys are interested to see what I love for this past month, stay tuned. So the first favorite is a little bit of unconventional because I usually don't talk about fashion here on my channel, but I could not help but to talk about these. These are the Quay or Key. I think it's pronounced Key. It's Q U A Y. And this is the style My Girl, which is. <sighs> I love them. Anyone who knows me personally knows that I love a really over large um, sunglasses, kind of that cat eye shape. But uh, what I really love about these is the. Um, the lenses. So my next favorite has to be a hair care product or hair care line and that is the Shea Moisture Manuka Honey and Manfure Oil Intensive Hydration System. I talked about in a previous video the um, hair mask and then I finally went out and bought the shampoo and conditioner which I love. I've only used the shampoo probably once this month to shampoo my hair but that one time I really enjoyed it so I definitely would add this to my favorites. And then the conditioner I have been obsessed with. Love this stuff for co-washing um, because it's really just great for a dry girl's hair and that is all me. If you guys are interested to see those kind of in action a little bit, I will put down my deep conditioner that I recently just filmed so you guys can see Next that. has to be the Basin White kind of bath bombs. I talked about this, I believe it was in my Vegas haul. And this company, I didn't hear about them, I didn't know about them until I actually went to Vegas a few months ago. I can't get it open. But um, they have the bath bombs, which I love. But the one that I have been obsessed with is their lemongrass one. And I have been using, I think I bought three or four of them. And I used two of them this month, so <laughs> don't run out. But these are so amazing. If you guys are looking for a bath bomb or more um, kind of like bath products, you can definitely check this company out. I'll leave all that link and information down. So my next products, or few products actually, is makeup. So the one that I've been loving or recently have fallen in love with is the LA Girl Pro Conceal. This is their high definition concealers. I purchased them in two colors, one more of a highlight shade and one more of like an everyday kind of concealing shade. And this here, for two bucks is a really really good find. I found mine I believe it was at my local beauty supply store and they were like a dollar and some change. Um, so really really inexpensive but I've heard really really good things about it and since trying it pretty much for the month I would recommend anyone who's looking for a really good and concealer. lastly our two lip products. The first one is probably my favorite everyday neutral lipstick and this is NARS Dolce Vita, which I am obsessed with. So it's kind of like a rosy tone type of lip, but what I like about it, it's very, very like, I don't know, it's very like, I don't want to say lip-like, but it just gives my lips a little bit of hint of a tint, hint of a tint, haha, <laughs> I rhymed, um, without looking overly like, you know the situation here. And lastly, even though it is a new buy, but I can already tell I'm going to be obsessed with these. This is the Anastasia Liquid Lipsticks. I'm currently wearing one. This is one of the newer ones that recently came out for their fall line, which is called Seraphine or Seraphine. Yeah, Seraphine. And then I also got Heathers. These are my... Oh, I like literally took them out of the package and was like, put them on my lips real quick. But this is a really, really pretty color. It's kind of like... um. Depending on your skin tone, it goes goes on like a true red, like this, but it's got kind of like a magenta undertone to it, so it makes it a little cooler and a little more wearable than like a true red lipstick, which I love. And then the Heathers, it's so hard to describe this color, but it is just gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see this, but Heathers is the darker color, and this one here is Seraphine. It's not red but it's not pink I don't know like it's like a I don't know how to describe it but I love it clearly so if you guys are interested into purchasing these link and all that information is down below so that is it you guys a very very small favorites like I say I tried to kind of you know compress these down as much as possible but if you guys enjoyed these videos don't forget to this 
a thumbs up to let me know to continue doing favorites videos. If you're new to my channel, definitely hit that subscribe button for more stuff to come from moi. And until next time, you guys, I'll see you soon. Bye. Oh, look out. She's a